Hi everyone, it's Diane at the Picket Fence Greenhouse and Gardens. Today is such a beautiful day out. We're on October 21st, I believe. And we are still having some really nice weather here in Iowa. And I thought, I'm going to shoot another video today. And we are going to talk about watering your plants in the fall, your newly established plants, and also some of your established plants in the fall. If you are experiencing a drought, dry time, um, I was looking out in my woods today and I noticed some plants that are just almost laying flat. Now, we, granted, we have not had a hard frost yet, so we can't blame it on that. I can see that they're needing watered. And we haven't had a rain here for probably, I would say, a good month, which was unusual because we experienced rain all spring and summer and lots of it. So now it's like totally different. We are experiencing a dry spell. Harvest is going really well, and I'm going to show you some some video of some plants that you're going to know if they need watered. Uh, they're going to be kind of wilted, um, laying a little flat in your landscape, and we're going to go take a look at that right now. Um, I do want to say, I want to stress is watering in the fall is very, very important to assure that your plants come back the following season, especially the newly planted perennials. Okay, you want to assure that they are moist, especially when we get you get cold. If you're in a cold climate and you, it starts freezing at night and stays freezing, you want to make sure you get them watered in before that. So let's go take a look at it right now. I'm going to show you some perennials. Okay, this one here is a ligularia, and you can see how it's laying kind of flat, and it looks totally dry, and it is. It's 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 needing some some water right now. I'm going to go over here to my Golden Tierra Hostas. They too are dry around this tree and I will get them watered in this week. Okay, here's a Japanese painted fern. These didn't look like this early in the season because we had so much rain, but look how limp they are. And I said, you know, we haven't had a frost, so we can't blame it on that. Also, the crack in the ground right there. We are dry, so I get this watered in before we the ground actually freezes and all the plants will be fine. I kind of do this every season, so I just want to say that <laughs> Joe Roxy, hi babe. There she is. She had to come out here and help today, but um, I just want to, you know, just just a reminder or a tip is to if you want to keep your plants healthy, thriving, and coming back every year, make sure that you water them in in the fall. Now that's only if you're in a dry area or if it's really dry in the fall. So you guys take care and we'll talk to you on the next one. Bye.